Now, Storm Team 2 Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis with the Miami Valley's certified most accurate forecast. And we have a muggy night on the way. There is a weak cold front that will be passing through the state tonight, and that will keep our winds out of the northeast, bring us some very slightly cooler, slightly less humid air for tomorrow. Still very warm, though, on Tuesday, uh, even though we do get that drop in humidity. And then the heat and humidity come right back Wednesday through Friday. It'll be hot, even quite hot as we get to Thursday and low rain chances throughout the week. Uh, we're only pegging about a 10% chance Wednesday, Thursday, maybe bumping up toward 20% at the end of the week for Friday and Saturday of a spotty shower or thunderstorm. This evening, our forecast uh, calling for 87 degrees at 7 o'clock, 82 at 9 p.m. with 78 at 11. And we'll be looking for uh, mostly clear. And some partly cloudy skies overnight. 71 degrees at 8 o'clock tomorrow, 82 at noon, and 87 at 5 p.m. with mostly sunny skies. We do have excessive heat warnings to the west of us, St. Louis, Kansas City, up to Omaha, an excessive heat watch, Chicago to about Indianapolis, and there's actually a heat advisory in effect uh, for at least the southwest corner of our viewing area down into Butler County, but also southeastern Indiana and Cincinnati. That's in effect until 9 o'clock this evening with a combination of the temperature, humidity up around 100 or even a little bit higher than that. Lows tonight, mid to upper 60s north, and it looks like upper 60s to about 70 in the southern half of our region. There's that weak front dropping through, so that's why it's slightly cooler up north and low to mid 80s north tomorrow with temperatures down here in the Dayton area up to about 88 with 86 in Eaton and uh, readings up near 90 around Cincinnati. On Wednesday, upper 80s north, looks like low 90s here around Dayton. And uh, checking out the Bryant Heating and Cooling Systems camera, our time lapse this evening and afternoon, uh, just showing some fair weather clouds out there, so mostly sunny sky right now with live Doppler 2 HD. Completely dry, a few clouds to the north of us. Some of those will drift across the area tonight with that cold front dropping south. High pressure up across the Great Lakes will bring that uh, northeast wind and that slight drop in temperatures and humidity tomorrow, but plenty of heat and humidity south and west of us, and that builds right back up over the area through the middle part of the week. There are very low rain chances as we go through Friday and even into Saturday. Right now, 89 in Dayton. We have a north wind at 5, 96 for the heat index. Our weather checkers tonight, Barbara Richards and Kettering in the low to mid 90s, Jason Thompson, Brookville at 90, along with uh, Bill Telzero in the Fairborn Beaver Creek area, and the low Stetters in Jamestown at 90, but up in Bell Center, Jeff Cador right now at 85. Just some clouds drifting through tonight. No precipitation expected. Dry conditions tomorrow. Here's your forecast tonight. We expect a partly cloudy night, even at times mostly clear, muggy overnight low 68. That humidity drops a little bit during the day tomorrow. Mostly sunny, but still quite warm with upper 80s. A northeast wind at 5 to 10. And then hot and humid on Wednesday, 92. Uh, 96 on Thursday for the high temperature. Morning low, only 74. 76 Friday morning, but 92 for Friday afternoon as the next cold front drops into the area. That will also bring the chance of a shower or thunderstorm and the front still close enough to keep a low chance of rain Saturday, but cooling off over the weekend.